my name is Barbara and I've been caring for children a couple of years now, so I'm coming into my third year, probably about 20 years ago. I was having a difficult time in my life and uh, somebody helped me and I always wanted to repay that kindness. So I thought that uh, foster caring might be a good way for me to achieve that. It took me about 10 months to become a, an accredited foster carer from the time that I made the call until the time I was given the okay to start having children. When I told my children that I wanted to become a foster carer, they were a, a little bit worried at first, especially Ben, he's 27 and he, he likes to protect me. Very quickly, both he and Amy, who she's 30 now, uh, they realised that Ozchild were not going to give me children that I wouldn't be able to manage by myself. Some of the placements that I've had have been uh, with kinship, so that means the uh, grandparents who need a break, they have the full-time care of children. It gives me great personal satisfaction and enjoyment to give children the opportunities that perhaps they wouldn't normally get to experience. I'm particularly interested in musical theatre and the arts and so we, I took her to see some shows and she absolutely loved them. We saw The Wizard of Oz and The Witches of Eastwick and then I found out later when she went into year seven that she auditioned for the school musical and I thought that that was absolutely terrific. I have a case manager and uh, we debrief on a regular basis. If I've ever had any problems, I either ring them or email them. Also, there's the buddy program and I'm a buddy, so that means I've done some extra training and I've got six uh, new foster carers. They can ring me at any time and, and have a chat if anything's concerning. I've been to quite a few social activities. Uh, and that has been a chance for me to engage with other foster carers and also workers. It might be a little grain of sand, but it's my grain of sand.